All right, guys. Apex, when you guys, when you guys running, uh, when you guys installing or relocated new base bands like a six six forty eight and six six thirty, when you guys has only C band on site, probably you guys has just one fiber and uh, six six forty eight. Okay, so if that's the case, you guys need to add it two more fibers. Because the first fiber is be for the AWS, the third fiber, the second fiber is be for the PCS, and the third fiber is be for the L sub six. All right. The same for the six six thirty. So you guys has just one fiber run into this one. You make sure you guys has two fibers there. All right. Because you guys has just one. This port. It's because alarms and the router. The router is right there on top. So just be sure, 6630, make sure it has two fibers, two fiber links. And the 6648, make sure it has three link fibers, okay? That's only, that's only the way you can clean all the alarms and the, and the router. Because uh, these base bands is controlled by Ericsson. So the problem is the top router is controlled by Verizon, so you guys need to contact the switch for that guy uh, configure the port you will use and contact the Ericsson guys for see what ports we use in here. But yeah, the more important is make sure you're running these two fibers for this one and uh, make sure you got a second one for the bottom one and connect to the right ports on top. And I say the switch, if it told you what, what ports is be enabled. To connect the fibers so you guys see those lights those uh, those are green lights when you know how connection and the port the light be blinking like yellow so one time you connect the fiber it will change to green all right guys you guys have a question just let me know apex baby <laughs>